Go, let's go check it out. Go on, Flip tell me down. what's in it. Is there anything good? Oh, there's oh, there's 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 a bed. Wow. <laughs> there's an a a single bed in it. And oh, this is white. Oh no, is, yeah, this is this is carpet. Carpet, this yeah. Isn't even snow. Oh, this is fancy. All right, let's right. Put this here. Okay, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna settle down in in the end of the bed, and you need to tell me the story. So the way this works is I need to say what was it? A location, a person, and an object, and then you need to to make up <laughs> a, a story. That is involving all of those things, okay? It's gonna you, be scary. And you need to start telling the story immediately, like I did as well. <laughs> okay, let's no try, let's try time. this. Right. right, your location is the North Pole. <laughs> so <laughs> I wonder where I got that idea from. <laughs> your character is a frog with a top hat and a cane, okay? <laughs> you can choose. You can choose what their name is. And your object is... A rocket ship. Uh, okay, great. Um, it's going to be a spooky story as well. Okay. Uh, so there once was a frog called Rupert. He was a very fancy frog and liked to dress very fancy with a top hat and his cane. He was also the best scientist that ever lived. He managed to make his very own rocket ship because he dreamed of going to some place magical. He was fed up of his smelly old swamp. He's had enough of his smelly old wife frog. He didn't want to be in the smelly old swamp anymore. So he made his rocket isn't ship. Isn't he a smelly frog as well, though? No, no, like, he's... Isn't, he's, 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 he's isn't, no. He, isn't he trying to reach a bit out of his league if he's not going for another smelly frog? No, no he's, <laughs> it's, it's fine. He's, he's, he's wanting some, some, some nice smelling alien frog. Um, and that's where he wanted to go. He wanted to go to some place new. So he jumped I've never heard you say ship. nice smelling alien frog in your life, Squid, but I'm glad you did. <laughs> jumped in his, Sorry, carry his, on. his rocket ship. It was, a, it was a dark Sunday evening. It was the perfect conditions. <laughs> dark and Sunday. Um, dark and jumped Sunday. In, <laughs> set the coordinates. It was the worst combination. <laughs> so, dark. And so, please stop interrupting me, Stamps. This is very I'm sorry. Cool. I just enjoyed it so much. I just can't right. help Got in his ship. It. Um, his cane got stuck, so he had to he had to leave his cane behind. But he, he didn't mind because it reminded him of his smelly old wife and his smelly old swamp. So he threw it out the window. Why was she really skinny? Got, got in his <laughs> rocket ship. No, she was a she was a stick. That's, that's all she was stamped. Um, a stick in the mud. Stick in the escape. Um, great. So she got in. He got in the rocket ship. He, he said farewell. Threw his stick at his wife. And set off on the grand adventure. And things were going well. Set off fine. Pretty good. Um, then things started to go a little bit wrong. As he reached the atmosphere, his, his, his rocket ship started to make some creaky noises. And he started to get a bit sad. He started to miss his smelly old wife. There was a picture on his console where all these buttons were. And he picked it up. But as he picked it up, he pressed the, a lever. Which sent him back towards the earth. But he wasn't going anywhere near his swamp. He... He blacked out and crash landed on the North Pole stamps. <gasps> yeah. Um, and then he got out, wondered where he was. Carry on, he, Squid. <laughs> he, res he, wrestled, he wrestled the polar bear. Um, and then the polar bear ate him. And that was it. The end. Oh, fat Squid. <laughs> fantastic story. You should, you should write books. Yeah. You should write story books. Yep. I probably I, should. I didn't see that ending coming. I didn't. <laughs> I didn't. Ah, oh. bravo, Squid. Bravo. Thanks, mate. <laughs> ten out of right. ten. Look, can you can you can you see? Oh, is this where the rocket crashed? <laughs> Look, this is this is the frog. Oh, you just picked up his body. Oh, what was it? It's a, it's a frog's frog's fish. Just... <laughs> 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 oh, that was a fantastic story. It was dark. And Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I love I love books like that. The ones Do that you I have. I've never read any like quite like Actually, that. To be I, honest, I think with. I, I think I've got like a different market. You're, like badly written books by Squid. 
Yeah, a, a smaller market than than most books. <laughs> I think they do all right. You know, I think um, I think it's, it, it'd be very successful. Yeah. Well, p- people are still watching the video at this point after hearing the story, so I, I guess that's something. <laughs> Can you imagine like a proper like high budget film for like one of my books? <laughs> like that'd be amazing. Just just someone <laughs> recreating it, just for one of your stories. Yeah.